On to other news of the day. The nice weather. The sun was out. Things started to finally warm up a little bit. Yeah, pretty enjoyable, which as Chase Moffat explains, that spelled prime time to get that car washed. Dirty car. Car experts say waiting longer than a week to get the salt off of our tires and the body of the car could be damaging. We found the car washes packed. Out on a Saturday, spraying down his mom's car, 14-year-old Christian Hermosillo is what you might call sort of an expert. I want it to get, we don't want all the salt that's on the street um, killing all the ice to kill our cars and make them rust. We don't need that on these cars. We're going to keep them clean. His parents own a car lot off L Street, but today it's more fun than work. Helping out my mom, and it's kind of fun just spraying the car down. In fact, there was a line of cars and trucks waiting for a scrub at this do-it-yourself car wash off Saddle Creek. And I came to wash my truck today because uh, the other automatic car wash was too full. Wow. So I found out it's, uh, I got a good bargain. But we've seen Omaha City trucks working hard this winter thus far, laying down brine and sand. <laughs> it's not hard to forget that ice-covered Tuesday morning this season either. So how is the city's supply of slick street treatments? And the city tells me they have plenty of brine. They make it in-house here, and they also have plenty of salt. They ship that in from Kansas. So they're ready for whatever the rest of winter will throw at them. A small break today, finally seeing warmer temperatures. The salt left behind. Well, it's the sound of money to car wash owners and a bright spot in the week for drivers. With photographer Alex Hassel, Chase Moffat, WWT 6 News. Experts say now is also a good time to check those fluid levels, including antifreeze and washer fluid. And don't forget, tire pressure can also be affected in this colder weather.